Hello, I'm Michelle Yana-Chan, your global guide with top tips on the world's best events in the coming month. There'll be dance moves from Budapest to Buenos Aires, as well as some gruelling challenges in Sweden. But first, never mind that it's summer in the French Alps, Courchevel is hosting the 25th Ski Jumping World Cup on August 13th and 14th, bringing together the world's best in both men and women categories. The public can enter a virtual jumping competition to measure themselves against the real talent. And if you don't need snow to ski jump, who needs water for a boat race? In Australia's desiccated heartland, the Henley on Todd happens on August 15th, held on a dry riverbed. In the 1960s, the town of Alice Springs proposed a regatta resembling something like the one in Henley on Thames in the UK, in spite of the fact that the nearest large body of water was 1,500 kilometres away. The sandy bed of the Todd River becomes a racetrack for a fleet of handmade boats. In the USA, the Central Park Film Festival plays from August 25th through 29th in New York City. The open air screenings are free and will happen come rain or shine. This year's movies include The Blues Brothers and Superman 2. They're dancing in the Argentine capital in August. The Buenos Aires Tango Festival showcases live music in the city's streets and squares. There are concerts, free dance classes, film screenings and en masse open air milongas. Plus the World Dance Championship pits tango's best couples against each other. Festival season is in full swing across Europe too. Hungary's capital Budapest hosts the week-long Seagay Festival. Nearly half a million come to the location on Obadai Island in the River Danube. Starting August 10th, hundreds of artists will take to the dozens of stages. Florence and the Machine, Robbie Williams and Kings of Leon top the bill. Look out for the BK Europe stage, which will showcase some of the continent's most promising musicians. On August 28th, the Aarhus Festival begins in Denmark with a free concert headlined by local musicians Stefan Brandt and Thomas Helmig. There are also performances by the Royal Danish Theatre, a series of concerts called Trio, which pull together world-class musicians in debut performances, a one-day improv jazz festival, a cabaret nightclub. The festival continues through September 6th. Across the Kattegat from August 8th, it's the three-day Delsland Canoe Marathon in West Sweden, a 55-kilometre course crossing the lakes and waterways of this region of wilderness with a chance of seeing elk, deer or moose. About a 1,000 competitors take part, lining up to start at the same time. This is Sweden's largest canoe event and one of the world's most rigorous. When you reach the finish line, there's a crayfish party to celebrate. In the US, in South Dakota, the 75th Sturgis Motorcycle Rally draws half a million spectators. Beginning August 3rd, the rally passes through the Black Hills from Deadwood to Custer State Park with a spectacular route, including the Needles Highway, Iron Mountain Road, and Spearfish Canyon. As well as motorcycle shows, there'll be demo rides and races. That's my global guide this month. Let me know what's happening in the place where you live or where you love. We're on email and across social media. Until next time, happy traveling.